Yo, what's going on guys, this is Soul Tracker, and today we're going to be starting the very first episode of our script coding, and today we're going to be doing join rewards. So this will basically, when a player first joins the server, you can give them specific rewards. So that is what we're going to be coding today. If you guys don't know how to install your script plugin, there will be a card on the right hand screen that will take you to a video of how to install it and get it all set up and ready to go. So before we get right into the coding part, I just want to say that I do have a Discord dedicated to like server help and also has like script help if you guys are brand new to this. So feel free to join the Discord if you need help with any of this. And the code will either be down in the description or on a pastebin so you guys can go use it for your server. So let's get right into it. Alrighty, so we are on a server, so we're going to go into our plugins and then into our scripts folder. And then into that script folder, we're going to go into our name, main script folder. So this is where we're going to be placing all our code, all our scripts. And as you see, when the, the plugin loads, it has all these examples. I would recommend you have those examples if you're very brand new into this, because there's a whole bunch of really good examples that you can, guys can learn from this. So for me, I'm going to go ahead and delete everything because I don't need it. So I would go ahead and delete it all. So if you do have it all deleted to make a script, you want to go to a text document. And then I'm just going to call this join. I'm going to go ahead and open it. And then I'm going to go and save it as. Then we want to go to all types and then just put join.sk at the very end. Close that off, and then as you see, we have a text file and an SK file. So I'm going to delete our text file, and this is our script file that we're going to be using for this tutorial. So this link will be down in the description. This is going to be your friend. I would definitely recommend you bookmark this page if you're brand new to script coding because there is a full documentation page that you guys can learn from this. So as you see, we have events, condition, effects, expression, types. So we're going to be dwelling on the events. So the best way to describe an event is if a player breaks a block or if a player runs or if a player PVPs or hits something or uh, a zombie hits a player. That is called an event. We're going to be using the join event for this video. There are two types of events uh, on join events. There is the normal on join event where a player will join your server for the first time or when a player just reconnects every time after like five or six times they join the server. So as you see, we're gonna do the on the first join event. So this is gonna be on the first join. So that is the very first time a player joins your server. The events have to be on a single line. So as you see, there's a whole bunch of events over here on the side that you guys can look at. So for example, if we do like item merge, so that is an event. As you see, it's on one single line, and then there's a colon. So the best way to describe coding um, with scripts is think of it as a YML format if you're familiar with uh, configuration with plugins. So YML format, for example, you have the first line, then there's a colon, and then there's the second line. So we'll get more in depth uh, when we actually start coding, but as you see, each event has its own specific line. So every one of these for example, as you see on achievement get, that's its own line, and then there's a colon. So we're going to be doing the first join event for our video today. So this is on first join, and then this is like the second part of the code. We don't need to worry about the set stats to zero. We're just going to be doing the on first join event, and then we'll give a player a reward when they first join the server. So here is our join SK file that we made. So we're going to go ahead and open it, and it is completely empty. So let's get started on the coding part. So as you saw, we're going to be using the on first join event. So we'll do on first, if I can spell right, on first join, and then we'll put a colon. The best way I can describe to you of how to code um, with script is try to think of it as a YML format in like a normal plugin. So you would have your first line, you would have a colon, you would have like an indentation, you would have a second line, and then you would have, then you would have your item here, and then you could have another um, council here. So that's just Think of it as a YML format. When you have your colon, you always need to have a space or a tab. So when, when you're coding with script, you can either format it using your spaces or tabs. I personally like tabs because I just hit tab, move to the next line, and you're good. So this is our first join. So we have a colon. That's the only thing we can put on our like our top line. So I'm gonna hit enter tab. So now we have our tab. 
so let's go ahead and give the player something so we'll go ahead and give player and then we'll give them five diamonds so that will give the player five diamonds so to make sure that they got those five diamonds we'll send a message so you can go with send so when you're sending a message to a player you will need your um, quotation marks to cover both the sides so you can also use color codes with this so we can go ahead and do um, do yellow so we'll put it with brackets or something and uh, we'll say welcome to our server and then we'll do a next line so we'll do two quotation marks there and then we'll say you got five diamonds you got five diamonds with a little exclamation mark and then uh, since they're joining for the first time will also make a broadcast so if you're used like the essentials plugin you could override disable the first join message with the essentials plugin so i'm gonna go ahead and do a broadcast and then when you're broadcasting you also need the quotation marks so we'll say uh, welcome welcome and then you can use the player's name so to get the specific player's name you do a percent sign player and then you can also close it off with the percent sign that will specifically broadcast that specific player that joined so we'll welcome player and then we'll do to my server and then that pretty much ends it off and then the next line we're going to do is stop and that basically just stops the event just pauses it in its track because it has finished our code so we got six lines of code here now to implement that into our server what you want to do is go ahead and save it, obviously, and then we'll go in game. Before I reset the world, I'm actually going to go into the essentials uh, config and delete that uh, the first join message that pops up. So I'm just going ahead and delete this real fast, just like so, and save that. And then I can go ahead and delete my world. Go ahead and delete the world file. Oops. We'll go ahead and delete the whole world, just like so, and then we'll start up my server go ahead and join the server we are logging in for the first time as you see welcome soul striker to my server fantastic so as you see welcome to our server you got five diamonds i did in fact get five diamonds we have our message and we also have our broadcast so that is how you code a first join rewards very simple very straightforward as i said look up on that documentation page everything that you can do with the different effects uh different events just everything that you guys can do because it's very very helpful and it uses plain english so i definitely recommend you guys try to mess around with it and get it to how you want because there are so many different things that you can do but uh, that is just the very basics. Next, what we're going to be doing in our next tutorial is going to be using the same code, but we're actually going to be adding a player counter. So that means that you can have a player counter when like the number one player joins or number two player joins. So that is what we're going to be doing next episode. I hope you guys did enjoy this tutorial. Let me know if you guys have any questions or comments. Be feel free to come visit my Discord if you guys need other help. I'll see you guys next time. Peace.